Hello. Welcome back to Forever Freaky Funko. Just showing off my new shirt from Hot Topic. Looking fly. So, thanks for joining me on this video, guys. As you can see in the title, it is part two of my Comic-Con exclusives. Because it took a long time to get everything to come in. And I mean a long time. Some of the stuff was on back order. Like I had to wait for the back order to come in. Crazy. So, video's a little bit late after the Comic-Con already ended. But I finally got everything in. So, I'm just looking around to where to even begin. So, um, if I don't remember the names, I'm going to try to remember the names of the, the stores I got these at. But I might not remember them all. So, um... First, and you can see because they're all going to have this sticker here. I got the Mickey Mouse 2-pack. This was an M, I believe this was a shared Amazon exclusive. So black and white Mickey Mouse. Really cute, just very small figurines. These are made by Funko. And um, yeah, these are really cool. So like I said, it has all of them on the back. But these are the the uh, Comic-Con ones from New York Comic-Con. So I picked up that one from Amazon. I also got this one from, I believe this one was from Amazon. It's been, you know, this one was one of them on back order, but I did get it. It came in pretty decent condition. The one and only from Crimes of Grindelwald. Augury. Wow. I did not think I was going to end up getting this one. Because I even got a notice from Amazon that said um, this item is currently unavailable after I had already bought it. Do you still want to cancel? Do you want to cancel your order, or do you still want to keep it? And then when it comes in, we can ship it to you. And I said I'm not canceling anything. So um, to be honest with you, there was two Funko Pops I was waiting on to do this video. This was one of them. So how awesome is that? How awesome is that? Check Amazon. I think I think Augury still might be available. But not anymore on pre-order. When I ordered it, even though it came out... So, during the night when all these got released, Amazon didn't have Mickey Mouse and Amazon didn't have this one. I had to keep looking and two days later, I finally was able to see them online. So, I ordered them. But both of them were not in stock. Now, Mickey got in stock like two days later, but um, the Crimes of Grindelwald, that one didn't come in until a while. So, that wraps up that one. So, from Books a Million, this one came in. This was my last one that came in. So, I was waiting for the Predator, Fugitive Predator, to do this video. And this is a New York Comic Con exclusive because Fugitive Predator, and then look at the legs. Mm -hmm. You can see, it's hard to see, but the, you can see the legs are, are transparent on the Fugitive Predator. So, and don't forget, you can still get the black metal Predator, unless it's sold out. It should still be available on FYE, which is an FYE exclusive. $15 because it's an FYE exclusive, but um, just reminding you on that one since we're talking about the Predator. But this one's really cool. And uh, pick this one up at Books A Million. And they still might have these available, so definitely check if you like them. But I had to get the Predator, so very happy to have him in my collection. Then, from Entertainment Earth, this was another one. They should have had it ready, but they didn't. It was on back order. It came in. It came in before all these other ones, right? But it came in. Uh, Spider Woman. This was a must-have for me. It was in my top ten. Spider Woman, um, New York Comic Con exclusive, and I had to have her, and now I do. She looks really cool, and she belongs to kind of that series right there. And I do have Captain Marvel, I have Spider Gwen, um. I do have Dr. Octopus, I have Gwenpool, I have Dr. Strange. 
Uh, I believe I even have She-Wolk. I do have She-Wolk. Hulk, I'm sorry. I just don't have the red She-Hulk from... Is she from Target or Walgreens? The red one. I don't have that one. Um, one of those, she's an exclusive. But yeah, we got Spider-Woman. So pretty cool. Very, 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 very cool. So, the next one... Now, this one I like a lot. Because not only is it a New York Comic Con, but it's only limited to 3,000 pieces. So this is from FunkoShop.com or ShopFunko.com. Either way. Huckleberry Hound and Snagglepuss. Vinyl from Hanna-Barbera, which is one of the very first licenses besides um, Betty Boop that um, Funko ended up getting. And so... They make a lot of Hanna-Barbera stuff. But I love vinyl. I love these two characters. But I love mm. 3,000 pieces. Oh, yeah. So, whew. I don't know if this one's still available. It could be. Um, because, again, vinyl. This is made by Funko. Still Funko. But vinyl is one of those products that a lot of people don't buy for whatever reason. But I think they're cool as all heck. And I have a lot of them. I mean a lot. So that's the back of it. Kind of showing you pictures from the cartoon. Um, so that's really cool that there's only 3,000 of these in the whole world. And I have one of them. Mm. <laughs> so pretty awesome there. Um, this one was also from Funko ShopFunko.com or FunkoShop.com. This is Knives, I'm probably going to pronounce it wrong, from Scott Pilgrim um, versus The World. This is Knives Chow, and if I pronounced it wrong, I am so sorry. But, even though it doesn't have the exclusive sticker on there, this was released during the Comic-Con. I got Knives Chow Cereal from FunkoShop.com or ShopFunko.com. And so, adding to my cereal collection. You remember I told you I had two more boxes I was waiting on? Well, this was one of them. And I actually got this one in two days ago with the vinyl I just showed you of, of uh, Huckleberry and, and um, Snagglepuss. So, this came in the same box as that one. So, really cool. They do have a puzzle, but this one's a heart-shaped puzzle. Or a maze, I'm sorry. So, pretty cool. Very, very, very cool. So, while we're on cereal, this has nothing to do with um, the New York Comic Con, but show you this one. This is a Target exclusive. So, right in time for the holidays, you got Buddy, Buddy the Elf. And uh, he's got some maple syrup there in his right hand, which I love me some maple syrup. I don't know about putting maple syrup in cereal, but I definitely know about putting maple syrup on some pancakes. Some French toast and some waffles. What's cool about this one is the maple syrup is the maize on the back, right? So that's really cool. You're mixing it up, Funko. Finally, you're not giving us that same circle. What does it say there? Anyways, I never read that. Hey, kids, remember what it's like to sit in front of the TV on Saturday morning and watch cartoons while eating your favorite cereal? Well, Funko does. So we're bringing back Saturday morning to kids for all ages with our new sugar toasted Funkos. And remember, always have fun. Freddy Funko signing off. <laughs> so that's really cool. Actually, he says the same thing on that one. And if he's, if he's been saying it on the other ones, I haven't noticed. And I'm pretty good at noticing things. So then the last cereal, again, these last two have nothing to do with, um, they have nothing to do with, uh, New York Comic Con. But this is another Funko Shop exclusive, just like Knives Chow was. And this is Lion O from Thunder, Thunder, Thundercats. Oh! So you're going to like the maze on the back. Still a circle maze, but we got a little extra on there. So who doesn't want some Lion-O cereal? <laughs> Man, that's so cool. And I'm not opening these things. They're in great condition too. Look at that. I've got the Thundercat logo right there. So 
Really cool stuff there, guys. Really cool stuff. And I ordered another one that was exclusive that came up and said, hey, get this one today. You know, it was very limited. Um, see if I can show you a picture of that one real quick. Um, because this one's really cool. And it, it popped up and it was available immediately. I don't know if it's going to let me... Let me see if I can go to... Um, well, it's going to be kind of hard to see because I don't have the original email anymore of the where it asked me to order it. But Captain Caveman cereal. You can kind of see it there. There we go. Captain Caveman. So that one is on its way. I ordered that one today from FunkoShop.com. So it was one of those where I told you guys about where you got about five minutes to order it. It might still be available. I don't know. All right, let's wrap up the video. We're 11 minutes in. I got five more to show you. I have not opened these up. These are from Hot Topic. This is why I love Hot Topic. Look, they box every individual Funko Pop, and then they ship it into a larger box with bubble wrap. So none of these should be damaged. I've never had one of these come in damaged. These are all from Hot Topic. So um, I believe this one yet. Yeah. Okay. So this one became available later on. I've already shown you this one. Um, so I went ahead and got a second one of her because she's awesome. But five star Harley Quinn pink and white exclusive. So that one became available online for a little bit. I bought it and um, it didn't come in the same box as these ones did. But um, that one did pop in too. So... Because the one I got in the store was kind of dented. So I wanted to get one that was nicer condition. I kind of forgot which ones these are. Ooh. Ooh. So. I got. The box is in pretty damn good shape. I got Carnage. This is the Carnage with the symbiotes com coming out of him. As you can see there. Let me kind of turn around. Look how cool his eyes look on this one. Ugh. And then you see him. You see where the symbiotes are kind of coming out like like veins or little uh, vines or something. Yeah, that's really cool. You can kind of see that on him there. Sorry with all the glare, guys. Um, trying to do my best here without having to open these up. Because these are collectibles. So I really don't want to open them. Um, and he sold out everywhere, so you can't even find this guy anymore. But these ones I bought the night of, um, so I didn't have to go to Hot Topic. But then again, I had to go to Hot Topic because of Killer Frost was sold out. And so was Harley Quinn was sold out. And so I had to go to pick up those two. And you guys remember the story, hopefully, about that one. So here we go. This one's still available in stores, I think even online, but I don't care. I love her. Tokyo Ghoul. This is Ito, and mm -hmm. she is awesome. Had to have her in my collection, so very happy that she is there. And I love how she's just pointing, how she's kind of like pointing at you. I'm going to get you. Yeah, she is so cool, and she belongs to that two-piece set there. Of Ken. So, and I have both of those two already. So, there's Ito. Really cool. I'm not going to put them back in the boxes. I don't know why I keep putting them back in the boxes. Soon I'm going to be doing a video for you guys. I'm going to show you my updated room. And when you see my updated room, um, yeah, I'm going to have to take you into the closet for you to get a sneak peek of, of the extension of my collection, how it's went into the closet and pretty much have, has taken over the complete closet. So had to get classic Wonder Woman. Um, I did find this one again in the store, but the box wasn't perfect. And I know when I order from HotTopic.com that the boxes are going to come in near mint condition as they always do so i went ahead and ordered her i mean i went ahead and picked one up in the store 
um, just in case, but um, I'm very happy to have two of her because I love Wonder Woman so much. See, and that's her in the comics right there. That's where they're getting it from. So great look. Great job, Funko. You guys did an amazing job on this one. And don't worry, I only have one more to show you and this video is wrapped up. So Wonder Woman, and then last but not least, I can't even remember which one this is. Ah, I love this one. I just need the Walmart version of her. Walmart version, they don't have it yet. But I got my baby girl, Caroline in pajamas with holding an ice cream. And I think she's amazing. I have all the Caroline Pops. And I love her hair. Looks, It almost m reminds me of... Um, what's that candy you chew that has that weird... Licorice. Licorice. Her hair looks like licorice to me. <laughs> or you know what else it kind of looks like too? Some of you that might know what I'm talking about. When you grab, when you get one of those big league chew bubble gum packs and you open it up and they're like stringy like that oh don't you uh, i still to this day i still buy big league gum it is the best you open up it's got that powder on it especially if it's grape oh i love the grape gum but um or the even the original but just putting that in your mouth and just chewing on that gum that old school man that, that but yeah that, that hair kind of looks like that too kind of looks like uh that type of gum but yeah she looks amazing i love i really love Coraline, and so that's you know she's in that series too so the only Coraline one that i'm missing would be the um walmart exclusive version of her and the chase i don't have her chase so i'm gonna have to look online and try to find her chase on on uh ebay so um that wraps up the video, guys. Thanks for watching. I know it ran a little bit long, um, but I have a lot of stuff to show you. So thanks for watching this one. I bought more stuff today that are that is out in stores. I got some unboxing to do from Walmart, some mystery minis that are Walmart exclusives that I haven't shared with you guys yet. I have some other uh, another full case of mystery minis, completely different than what I've done to do that for you guys, made by Funko. I have uh, more Funko Pops to show you. So um, expect a lot of videos to be dropping over the next few days, guys. So thank you for watching this one. Enjoy your Friday night. And I will see you guys Saturday morning with a new video. So stay tuned. And don't forget, tomorrow, Saturday morning, sometime in the morning, um, I'm going to be doing the raffle. Okay, so if you haven't entered into it, um, I'm doing the raffle tomorrow for the 400 subscriber giveaway. And that's going to be that Venom box, okay? I'm going to be raffling that off tomorrow. So all you have to do is be a subscriber and uh, leave a comment on that video. As a matter of fact, I will do you a favor and I will put the link to that video in the description of this video below so you can click on it and make sure you are a subscriber and make sure you are entered. I'm doing that video, that giveaway tomorrow morning. When I say morning, right around 9, 10, 11 o'clock-ish um, central time. So thank you guys for watching. Please be kind to one another. I got a lot more content coming and I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.